What do you want? We want to see the torch. No one is allowed to see the torch. But we have important information about my father, Dr. Paul Flamand. We shall see. you. Oh, my darling Hillary, if only you knew how I've yearned for this day to come. Sleepless nights, lonely hours, hoping, praying that once more I would be able to gaze into your ravishing brown eyes. And who is this I should thank for bringing you back to me? Oh, Nigel, this is Nick. Nick Rivers. He's a friend. Forgive us, Mr. Rivers, if we have been less than hospitable. But recently we've had reason to believe that there is a traitor somewhere in the resistance. Ducroix, introduce the American to the men. Very well. This is Chevalier, Montage, Détente, Avant-Garde, and Déjà Vu. Have we not met before, monsieur? I don't think so. Over there. Croissant, soufflé, escargot, and chocolate mousse. Mm. Now, Mr. Rivers, what is the news that you bring us? I've seen Dr. Flamand in Flurgendorf prison. He told me the Polaris mine will be ready on Sunday. Sunday? Sacre bleu. This is my favorite. We'll have to move out tonight. I'll be back in a moment, my darling. Prepare the gear for the jump. Ak de Toyon. Nick, I want to explain. What's there to explain? But I just want Look, to say that... I'm not the first guy who fell in love with a girl he met in a restaurant who then turned out to be the daughter of a kidnapped scientist, only to lose her to a childhood lover who she'd last seen on a deserted island and who turned out 15 years later to be the leader of the French underground. I know. It, it all sounds like some bad movie. Forget it. It'll be better for everyone if we just forget what's happened. Mr. Rivers, we've arranged for your safe transportation across the border tonight. It's the least we can do to show our gratitude. Come, my darling. Let me show you what I've done to the fallout shelter. <laughs> 